Coach, congratulations. Just your thoughts after a really good victory at home in the Dugan. Yeah, it, it, it's always fun to play in the Dugan. I mean, the atmosphere is just terrific. You couldn't ask for a better crowd and the support that uh, the students gave and the and the season ticket holders gave. And um, I thought our guys res responded well to the environment, played with a lot of energy. You know, that's the type of environment that you have to have energy. If you come out in that kind of environment uh, flat, the crowd goes quiet and the other team gets control of the game. And fortunately for us, you know, we got behind a little bit early, but we were able to just chip away, chip away, chip away. And, you know, big credit to, to these two guys sitting to my left and right. Miles is a captain going into the game. What were some of the keys? And, and how do you think you guys executed some of those keys to the game? Uh, well, we knew they had a, a good big guy on the other end. So we talked a lot about rebounding with five guys. Uh, and I think we did a really good job of that tonight. I think uh, the, the rebounds were spread out wide. And uh, also just talking about, you know, bouncing back after a couple of losses. So uh, I think we really focused in. I saw it in everybody's, you know, eyes before the game that we were ready to go. They sometimes big opportunities present themselves. Can I step up onto it? Talk about kind of your performance tonight and what you saw out there and leading to a good game. Well, I feel like it started as a team thing. When I seen this coming out competing, when, um, when we came out competing, what kind of motivated me to keep it going when I came out. And I think it started when we had started in practice, the two days in practice before. Um, Coach Wilson stressed it after the game. He said, we competed in practice, we worked hard, <clears throat> and that's the result of it. Coach, we'll go back a little bit. The environment playing in the Duke is a different atmosphere. Some guys seem to beat off it. Talk about the crowd tonight. And the I, I just thought the crowd, again, I thought the crowd was terrific. Um, it, it's fun to play in an environment where the fans can make an impact. Um, it's a little stressful on on the vocal cords, but uh, and and I also think it's it, it just it just creates atmosphere. You know, it's uh, it, it's just really one of those things that the players look forward to, the coaches look forward to, and uh, obviously the students come out and can enjoy it and be a part of it. And I'm just grateful that for their support and grateful that we were able to get a win for them. You get a week off, which is rare, and you get to stay at home, which has been rare for us. What's, been, what's going to be the message in the next five, seven days leading up to Steve Air Boston next Wednesday? We're going to work on some things that we haven't really had an opportunity to work on. It's, it's interesting. We're going to work on rest first, getting some guys some off their feet a little bit and healing up some, some wounds and nicks and bruises. And then, uh, you know, from there, we didn't shoot the ball particularly well, and we haven't the last couple games, especially from the three. I thought we had some opportunities that we missed. So we'll get in the gym and we'll, we'll get back and start working on uh, some of those types of things. I think it's a nice opportunity for us to breathe a little bit before we get back on the, on the court for uh, game prep uh, as, as Stephen F. Austin comes in. One, one more thing that I do want to talk about. I mean, Jave really kind of touched on it with the effort that guys gave in practice. And credit to him, credit to for Perry, credit to Iggy. And, and all the other guys that came off the bench, they did a tremendous job in practice uh, really preparing us. And the, the biggest challenge for those three guys in particular was they didn't get a lot of reps. In fact, I don't think they got any reps coming in this game with the blue team. And so to be able to run somebody else's offense and defense and then turn around and have to flip it over and defend it, I think it's a huge credit to those guys. Um, and I do think uh, I do think they're gaining a lot of confidence, and it shows in practice with the with the competition that we have. So I really want to give a shout out to the entire guys on the uh, that that don't start, and it's not just the it's just not just that next five, but it's it's everybody. It's a collective uh, effort mm -hmm. on everyone's part. Thank you, coach. Thank, Thank you. you.